Yo, it's your boy Shadowshack here, and welcome back to Digimon World Next Order for the PlayStation 4. And in the last episode, guys, we defeated Metal Endemon, and now our city is in the sky, which is really awesome. But today, guys, we're gonna do some more stories. If you guys are excited, make sure to hit that six like button, that'd be much appreciated. And in the last episode, I also mentioned that I was supposed to get Peldramon, right? But I did get Peldramon, but I decided to reload my old save file, so I could actually go for a different Digimon, which are Metal Garamon and Black War Grimmon. But before I do anything else, I just want to show you guys the clip of me getting Peldramon. So here we go. Alright guys, so now you saw it. So now the thing is, uh, as you can see, I have Metal Garamon and Black War Greymon. So yep, I decided to do some grinding. So for the people wondering how I, did, uh, I done that, let me just show you the pet. So this is the, you know, the pet I took right here. So simple pet, right? And then it's the same with this. But you know, you must go to Garumon to actually be able to digital to wear Garumon Black. You can't just go with, uh, you know, the other guy. Um, who is it again? Basically, you can go with Black Garumon for some reason. You really need to take this path to be able to, you know, get this guy. But yeah. Uh, but now, guys, that this is set off, we click here. Basically, we could uh, do a DNA evolution right now. But I'm not going to do it. I really want to do it. But trust me, we don't want to do it as of right now. But we will eventually, like maybe in the next episode or so. But for now, I want to try, you know, with this team. And before we actually go in action... We must do one last thing is to speak with Karmon and the reason why I'm doing this is to get an autopilot But now we are totally ready to go outside the city and continue through the story. Yeah, the rhymes are real, right? But I'm really 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 getting excited right now because this is gonna be really dope to have two of those guys on their side right now You know what I mean? Those are pretty strong Digimon and it was pretty easy. I actually got Metal Garumon at age 11, right? And for Black War Grimmon, it took a few more days. I believe it took uh, 13 days, but now um, those are their age. I mean, I'm pretty sure you guys saw it. But I actually decided to do some more training afterward just to make sure, you know, we're strong enough for what's to come. I have no idea, so I just wanted to make sure since, you know, the battle was getting very hard. So that's why I decided to do a little bit more of grinding. And what I wonder is, I think we actually gonna be able to do the Exus Digivolution in combat, so it's gonna be very useful if we can actually do it, because the Exus is way stronger than the rest. But anyway, here we go. You came. I'm sorry I got you wrapped up in this silly farce. I really have to apologize, Dakota. Ultimately, it was your kindness that I betrayed. Huh? What do you mean? I'm saying... That all that hubbub before was staged. The, the real traitor. Yes. I've had my doubts for some time now. But now that we're here, I'm very sure of it. There are big plans afoot now. There mustn't be even the smallest shred of doubt. That was the point of that farce. Who is the traitor? And what big plans? It's not yet 100% settled. I don't want to give out a name. As for the plans, I'll talk once the business of the traitor is settled. For now, ask no questions. Just come with me. Whoa, uh, I don't know what to think, but okay. I believe you, Mr. Mamio. Thank you, Koda. I take it that's fine with you too? I'm in your debt, both of you. So how will we flush out the traitor? Right now, Mire is feeding the suspect false information. In short, she's saying that there is an incredible secret weapon at Boney Resort. Secret weapon? That sounds stupid, but if I was the traitor, I'd have to check it out to make sure. Aha! Uh -huh. You want them to go check it out so we can tail them and pin them down over there. I doubt very much that the traitor will go on their own. It'll be one of their friends who heads there. That's why Mire and I have set a trap. Since hardly anyone ever goes near Boney Resort, if anyone falls into our trap, well, we'll know then. I see. You're completely prepared. I'll sneak on over, staying out of sight. 
You two should go on ahead to check it out first. Got it. Okay, let's race to Boney Resort. And it's time for us to head to Bunny Resort, guys. So first thing first, what we want to do is check the mail to see exactly where we need to go. So we need to go to the pink, uh, the pink stone house, which is on the top of Bunny Resort. So it's pretty far ahead, but that's where we're gonna go, guys. So hopefully you guys are excited now because I am. So I'll see you guys once I'm on the top because right now I'm actually gonna get some healing item and all that stuff because I feel like you know. If we go there, maybe something's gonna happen. I don't know, but we'll see. All right, guys. So here I am at the top of the mountain right here. So now it's time to head to the pink stone house. So the reason why I'm starting from here is because I want to show you guys the way to do it without, you know, getting into any battles in here. Because maybe some of you will love to know. So here we go. This is the way, and then you go right there through the middle. So yeah, just wanted to show you guys in case that maybe some of you are playing alongside with me. But anyway, let's go. What's this? No one said anything about traps. Ha! Oh, someone really is caught in a trap. Hey, you two. Why are you... Hey! You're not the ones who set this trap, are you? Which means all that talk about a secret weapon was a lie. A secret weapon? What are you talking about? The Infinity Cross. An extreme weapon that fires infinite energy. Oh, that? Nothing like that ever existed. What? Really? Thank you for falling for it. And now you'll talk. Yeah, I can't believe I fell for this. It's pointless. You won't get out of the trap that easily. Give it up. That won't do. If they find out I secretly left, only to fall into an enemy trap. No, I'm shuddering at the thought of it. In this case, I'll have to use my trump car. Oh! What's going on? You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> On your knee. What? How come that appeared when Metal Edamon called it? Is this another effect of the BH program infection? Enough power to control the enforcer? Okay then, Omega Mon Zwart D, finish those fools! All right, I wasn't expecting that at all, and now we really need to fight this guy. Are we gonna be all right though? Oh my God, guys, why is he so strong already? All right, I know how we're gonna win this is by doing our fusion. Like I said before, I could actually like had it already. You know what I mean? Like I could actually. Uh, fuse those two guys, but I feel like the X's will be way stronger for you know any battle and right now I'm not doing the uh, Order power right, so I'm gonna do it a little bit more right and as you can see yes I do have some recovery. I'm using the wrong one by the way. I just noticed that so we're gonna wait before using the auto power and we're gonna BAM here we go. Oh, it's not working as I planned. Oh, all right. All right. All right. Let's recover Jesus Christ If we don't be any guys as you can see we're gonna lose this battle so Sadly, it's the case. Alright, I really wish I could do it, but... Yo, why is this so hard? But the music is really good. Okay, good. I just think my other power, so... Alright, here we go. It's time to go into X's. Here we go. Hopefully, this will be good to defeat this guy. Extra Cross Evolution, baby. Alright. Let's do this. So, this is the second time where, you know, that we actually use the DNA Evolution. I mean, aka the X's DNA with, uh, you know... Uh, to get uh, Omnimon basically, his art. So it's pretty dope, you know. I really like how we're doing this right now because in the beginning of the game, you know, we get Omega Mon, but now we're getting Omega Mon Zord for doing it, so it's pretty, pretty dope. But at some point, guys, yes, I will be the energy of all of uh, those two guys so we can actually just use him like that. But anyway, is that actually Omega Mon or it's the uh, other version? Yeah, it's Omega Mon Zord. Just wanted to see. All right, so please tell me we can actually beat him now because if we can't we're screwed guys We're totally screwed because this guy is way too strong, but I really think we're gonna be able to do it Because look at this we have over 70,000 HP So it's really crazy like doing this. It's so much better than just doing the DNA evolution seriously All right, here we go. That's what I'm talking about now. We're not gonna lose All right uh, I'm just so happy. I don't want to just you know 
do that all the time, but like seriously, those battles are way too hard for us, so I don't have a choice, you know? So just deal with it if you don't like me doing this, but sometimes you don't have a choice. Because I don't know. Here we go. I'm trying to... Yes, here we go. I just think my attack pretty well right here. Alright. Here we go. It's pretty cool to see those two fighting right now. Let's be honest. Like seeing Omega Monzor versus Omega Mon... Uh, Zolt something. Yeah, I forgot his name exactly. I think it's like Zord D or something. Alright. Come on now. Yeah, I'm actually like having issue against this guy. Like, it's not like that easy even though uh, I'm using my freaking... Uh, X is right here as you can see. Oh, I can do this right now. Here we go. At this point, you know what I mean? Since you're stuck, it's time to do a good amount of damage. Here we go. Super Ganon, Jason's and Sword. Take this, man. How you like that? Bam! Will this be enough? I mean, it's almost over, guys. We're doing it. Alright. Here we go. Alright. Just one more hit, and it's over. All right, come on, come on, hide and seek, and boom, take that, buddy. Hey, the antivirus program. What's going on? Omega Mons War D fail? I didn't plan for this. We must retreat! We made it somehow. This is the Infinity Cross? Totally cool! And terrifying! Ah! But why are we so weak? Hang on, Mirei. What's the meaning of this? I came here just as you asked, but it's still all unclear. I need an explanation from you, Mirei! Loosh! How can you be so careless? You're the reason I ended up in this mess! Loosh, you know that thing? Not at all! Oh, brother! This is why I hate kids! Hey, get up! Get up and do something about them! That's right! That's the way to finish him! <laughs> what? How did I? Has the antivirus program worked to restore your sanity? I wonder. I still appear to be confused. Let's get out of here then. Maybe we should finish this. I think not. Omega Mon's Wart D has an important role to play from here on out. Is that what you meant by big plans, Mr. Mamio? Hang on. Let's leave it at this for now. The enemy will overhear the information. Oh, you're right. The traitor. It was Lush, right? What are you talking about? Could someone explain? I apologize, Himari. I never meant to trick you. It was all staged to make sure that Lush was indeed an enemy spy. I... I'm no traitor! I would never betray you! You seem to know nothing. But there is no doubt that you were the one passing information to our enemies. You were the only one I ever mentioned the Infinity Cross to and what it could do. No, but I... <sighs> What's the point? You've already seen inside the Trojan horse. Are you... Suzuki? What? Suzuki? It can't be. <laughs> What's going on? All this crazy screaming. Are you quite well, Master Shoma? Yeah. I'm fine, Kazuhaman. So, this is what the Enforcer's power is. We seem to have become too strong. Be not proud, Samu Draymond. 
Have you already forgotten the mighty blow you were dealt in days past? Of course not! That is why I kept fighting, getting stronger, beyond the ways of this world! No, no matter how wounded, a single shot at Omega Mon's war deed would... Master Shoma, what shall we do about them? Metal Etamon breathes yet. His role is now complete. We've gotten the data sample we need for the updated BH program. For now, do with him as you will. I will work on finishing the AR plan. Omega Mon's war D will soon be utterly broken. When that happens... <laughs> You're not the only one with special permissions. Hold on. Are you Shoma Suzuki? Are you the one who created the BH program? You were called to the digital world just like we were, right? If that's so, then why would you do this? To control all worlds. To create a new world. To break down the doors that separate the countless parallel worlds. Nothing will separate our worlds. A massive new world, rife with confusion, will be born. <laughs> Does it not make your heart sing? What are you talking about? I'm totally lost. That's fine. I don't need your understanding. You! One more step, and we will see it as a declaration of war! Proceed only if you are ready to die! <laughs> hm. Spineless coward! Why should I even bother fighting you? We're off, Kuzuhaman! Wait, there's still something we need to do. <laughs> I only fight the strong! I will leave this careless one to you! Even though Master Shoma has given you the right to handle the BH program infection, you'll still go off on your own. We almost lost Omega Mon's Wart D, who is critical for the coming AR plan to the enemy. An unforgivable crime. I only sought to please Master Shoma to achieve the level of the three gods of ruin. How absurd. You, follow in Titamon's stead? What? Weren't you friends? Little minds need not concern themselves with noble ideals. Damn. I hate this. But I was so frightened I couldn't move. As for me, I felt the same, if not worse, the first time I saw Omega Mon's Wart D. Fear may hold us back, but it would be awful if they got away with our ace in the hole. Let's do what we can before complaining about it. Regrets are for after all is said and done. Lush, come here. We might be able to figure something out if I can analyze your data. Yeah. All right. Mameo, I'll leave that plan to you and Gigi Mon. Understood. It looks like they've come for us. Let's go back to the city. The partners need to rest. I wonder if Lush is gonna be all right. I know. She looked about ready to disappear. I'm worried too. But let's let Mirei take care of her. We've got our own stuff to handle right now. Right. The master plan. That's right. Project Reincarnation. Talmon's brainchild. Reincarnation? That's being reborn, right? Wait. Or was that resurrection? Either would work, actually. You're pretty sharp, huh? This artist I like had a song called that on one of their albums. Reincarnation, as the name suggests, is a code name for the plan to bring about the rebirth of the digital world. This world was nearly overrun by the BH program update. As it stands now, 
recovery would be near impossible. As such, better to return it to a state of pure data, purge it, and let it be reborn anew. That's the idea, anyway. Purge the world and let it be reborn? Is that even possible? It wouldn't be easy. But with a Megamon's Ward D in our hands, it would be theoretically possible. So, an AR plan. Those guys need a Megamon's Ward D for their plan, too. What's AR supposed to mean? Normally, augmented reality, I think. But in this case, I can't figure out what they mean by it. I believe they were saying it's a grand plan to tear down all the gates that keep the parallel worlds apart. What would happen if you mashed the real world and digital world together like that? Couldn't say. But you can be sure it'd cause a real panic in both of them. At worst, two merging dissident worlds could interfere with one another so much as to lead both of them to ruin. As in, the world would end? We won't let it. We're gonna smash Suzuki and the others and take a Megamon's War D back. That'll stop the AR plan. Plus, make reincarnation possible. Here, here. How are you not terrified of them, Kota? I am. But how else are we supposed to save the world? Scared or not, we've got no choice. I don't know how much we can do, but let's do what we can. Right, Yukimura? Right! See how fired up you are, Kota. Yukimura! All right, let's go. Suddenly I feel like maybe we can actually do this. Looks like we've got no time to be scared either, Rika. Time to roll up our sleeves and get going. I don't think your sleeves are even long enough to roll up, Himari. Then I'm already good. Not to rain on the parade, but how exactly are we supposed to get Omega Mon's War D back? Oh, right. They've got that power like Mirai's where they can just come and go through space. So not only do we not know where they went, even if we did, we couldn't really chase them down. Well, then we'd better let Mirai in on the plan first. She ought to turn up here once she's analyzed Lush. Meanwhile, there's something I must ask of all of you. The other core of Project Reincarnation is the town of Flotia. Keep populating it until the plan is ready to go. Which means, time to gather more residents. Roger, leave it to me. <laughs> Guess there's a sunrise at the end of every night. You're one reliable bunch. We'll let you know when we hear from Mire. You help gather residents too. All right, so we know what we need to do now, guys. I wonder if we're supposed to get to 100 property now to be able to go through the game. But if that's the case, we're pretty close to it uh, already. And I do know who we're going to go for and all that stuff. So, yeah, guys, it's going to be so easy. But for now, that's going to be it for today's episode of Digimon World Next Order. So if you guys enjoyed, make sure to hit that subscribe button. And it seems like we can already continue. We didn't need to get anybody, so this is really awesome. So, yeah, guys, at the next episode, we'll be back with more story mode. I'm so excited. I mean, more story. I'm so excited, and I hope you guys are as well. And, uh, yeah, I guess uh, maybe we should wait till next day to continue if we need to find any boss so we can use X's because we really needed it last time. So, we may need it again. <laughs>